follow us on Instagram, like our Facebook page, and visit our website. PZ Engineering. Passion to excel. Hi, welcome to the PZ Engineering channel, Passion to Excel. In this video, we are going to show how to simulate a direct torque control with a space vector modulation of an induction motor. The idea of the system is electrical energy supplied by a three-phase AC to DC diode rectifier connected to a, a grid of 600 volts. The DC bus is connected to a three-phase two-level converter. This converter generates the variable voltage and frequency required for a variable speed operation of an induction motor. In addition, a braking shop is connected to the DC bus in order to dissipate the kinetic energy of the motor during deceleration. Before we start with our introduction, I'd like to request if you are not yet part of our family, please subscribe to the channel, share our contents, comment and like this video. You can as well donate to our channel or join our membership team to have access to our models, special attention and request, as well to have a guidance in your dissertation. Now let's introduce our system. All this community can get it from a library browser. We have grid diode rectifier, two level converter, induction motor, and we have our control system and have our scope. Grid, we have our grid parameters, 600 volt, phase angle, and our frequency. Here we have our bus bar, and you have our measurement from grid. Here we have our diode rectifier, universal bridge, we are using universal bridge and we change it to diode. Sorry. And we have our DC link. We have our braking chopper. Is to dissipate during a during a break. Here you have our two level converters. And here our bus bar, the measurements. Here is our induction motor. Those are the parameters. Configuration parameter advanced and you can see are using a synchronous machine. All those values will be in the description. If our signal and we have our converted to RPM. Is is the director control? All these videos you can get it from the description. Our flux stock calculation, our speed regulator using PI controllers, and this is our the reference.
we have our torque reference and flux reference speed reference flux reference and load the torque please don't forget to subscribe to the channel share our contents comment and like this video our measurement our scopes we have our v grid i grid vdc and our vabc They are up our grid now. Let's let's run our system to see the behavior of our system. let's check our scope supply we have our vabc the current and voltage we have our dc grid, dc we have the voltage in the current grid we have our vdc and we have the voltage from from the bus bar at the induction motor the bus bar that is uh, from the induction motor The grid, the grid voltage, 